All right. Hello, everybody. Uh, I just wanted to show you how to access videos from last year uh, from the email that I sent you. Um, so if we have students out for COVID due to or, or actually due to COVID um, and they have a lecture, let's reuse the lecture videos from last year. So how do we access that? So we go to uh, classes. View other classes. Now, more often than not, we're um, teaching the same stuff as last year. It'll change a little bit if you're doing anyways. 20 to 21. So let's say I've got some uh, 423 bit or 423 videos. So as a reminder, we kept all these in the topics. Uh, oops, sorry, expired. All right, so governance, I'm just using this as an example. All right, so these were um, the lecture videos from last year. Notice how we uh, divvied them up. Okay, so hit play, click on view in Microsoft. Pause this so we don't have double of my voice. OK, now the problem with Microsoft Stream videos is you got to make sure everyone has access. So. Click on the three dots. Update video details. Um, I'm just typing in Jones. Search. All right, let's say I'm teaching this kid right here. All right, so I would click on him. So now he has access to view this video. Hit apply. Then I click share. I copy that link. OK. And then so if I am sending him an email, all right. Um, I can say so who the hell was that? Jones. I want to say it was this kid. Hyperlink. Insert link. Okay. Now look, if you are so if you'll notice like here, I don't have access to this video. These are made by Mr. Rowe. Probably going to have to ask Mr. Rowe, hey, can you go back and add this student so he can have access to it? OK. Um, so that's an easy way. Ah, that's more of me. Good God. OK. Um, but. We have students, all right, but remember, we, we should have most of these lectures already, so that's what we need to do. Any other questions with the process, please let me know.